Uh, it certainly has been a hot, sticky day all across central Indiana today. Yeah, you got a feel for all those construction workers, everybody that was working outside today. This is at 16th and Central. We hope these uh, crew members got plenty of water because I think we can all agree it was pretty miserable today, wasn't yeah, it? Yeah, trying to avoid being outside <laughs> at right. all. And I can't imagine reporting into work for the day and being mm. out all day. All day long, they're going to need a nice cold shower. Yeah, <laughs> because and, and hopefully they hydrated all day long because it was sticky, as you mm. pointed out. Really high levels of humidity, unlike we've seen in 13 years. And I've got a little explanation on why it feels so uncomfortable. If we don't have high humidity, the dry air allows moisture to evaporate and that cools the body. But when we have this high level of moisture in the air, it limits evaporation, which makes us uncomfortable. And yes, we were uncomfortable today. Heat exhaustion safety. We want to make sure you remember this the rest of today and tomorrow as well. We've got one more day of this heat wave. Speaking of those high dew points, we hit 80 degrees for the first time since August of 2010 and we have one more hot, humid day on the way for tomorrow. Made it to 94, so not quite record warmth. That record of 98 still stands, set back in 1936. Our low this morning was a muggy 78. We're not going to get much relief overnight tonight either. 92 degrees right now, but with a dew point of 79, those feels like temperatures still close to 110 all across central Indiana. Hot again tomorrow with highs in the low 90s. Feels like temperatures again topping 100. There will be a storm chance, especially late tomorrow. This is 6 o'clock tomorrow evening, and you can see late Friday night, early Saturday morning between 11 p.m. and about 2 a.m. We start to see this complex, if it holds together, move through central Indiana with some rain, maybe a few rumbles of thunder. At this point, can't rule out a strong to severe storm, although it's a low risk across the southwestern part of the state. The good news, we get relief from the high heat, high humidity starting Saturday. 92 tomorrow, still a muggy start with a lingering storm south Saturday, 86. And then we're in the low 80s starting Sunday with comfortable levels of humidity all the way through Thursday of next week.